Calling all USATF fans, Olympians Dina Castor and Matthew Mitchell will be signing autographs for the USATF yeah. and put today at 345. Roberts, that was, his, that was the first throw of this flight, and he uh, had a sector foul, just barely. Looked like around 20 meters. Zach Lloyd. So back to the pole vault now, we have our winner, and that is Janet Shore. She has now elected to move the ball up to 4 meters 93. Six. So first miss for Shore, she will have two more attempts. Here is Hoffa in the shot put. Another one uh, out of bounds in the right sector. Go. Gary Kravis, 77 36, 253 feet 10 inches, New Javelin leader. Right, and so missed by Shore and Kennard at the same time. This will be the women's 800-meter final. In lane one, she was All-America in her freshman year at Stanford University, Amy Weisenbach. In lane two, the NCAA runner-up this year from the London Olympic Games, nice. running for Nike, Gina Gall. She the Olympic trials last year, was an All-America at UC Riverside, as the fastest time by American this year, second fastest time in the world, 158-18, Brenda Martinez. In lane six, four Ivy League champion, now running for Wazell in the New Jersey, New York track club, Kate Grace. Women, 880 final. Under 201 in the semifinals. And as is usually the case, to the lead with authority, that is Alicia Montano. Ajay Wilson behind. That is good to hit a decent free play. We bring it down the home stretch for the first time. Second, 
a 78. Just off her lifetime best, Ajay Wilson, 159, 55. That is a new one. You're right. Congratulations. 